I'm Christopher Zweig, and up next on CJ at the Movies, my review of Seth Rogen's new comedy made for HBO Max, An American Pickle. Let's take a look. This is a dramedy starring Seth Rogen in a double performance. The first character he portrays is a Jewish man from the year 1919 who immigrates to America with his one true love, gets a job at a pickle factory, and falls into a vat which gets concealed for a hundred years after the company's closure. A hundred years later, he wakes up to find out that everything has changed. It's been 100 years. The pickle brine preserved him perfectly. You're too old to do that. The world has changed. Everyone I know is gone. Everyone except his great-grandson, also played by Rogan, who is a struggling app designer trying to get his dream project on the market. But when the old-timer gets him in trouble, the two begin an unnecessary rivalry as the former decides to start his own pickle business and the latter plans to sabotage it. We will finally make their parents proud. Don't talk about my parents. You never met them! These are two of Seth Rogen's best performances because of how the actor plays both characters with passion and spark, and director Brendan Trouse, a cinematographer on Rogen's comedies, is able to convince us they're both in the same room. But An American Pickle is a missed opportunity which starts off interesting but takes a wrong turn in the pickle business plot. There should have been something wiser and funnier inside the characters, but it ends up being trivialized. So, skip it. Well, that was my mixed review for An American Pickle. If you like this review and other reviews coming up, please subscribe to my channels. And you can also read my written material at cjatthemovies.com. I'm Christopher Zweig. Stay safe, and I'll see you at the movies whenever we get back there.